welcome back to my channel welcome back if you are not new welcome if you are new if you have not subscribed to my channel go ahead and do so you won't regret it you'll enjoy the fun here um most days um i'm serious about certain topics some days i want to have fun with this some days i don't know what am i going to record okay so i'm being honest with you but you won't regret um subscribing to my channel so please do so um i want to say first of all thank you so much um guys for you all that have subscribed to my channel i truly 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 appreciate you um, I want to give a brief synopsis um, of when I first started my YouTube channel, although I'm still new. I'm, 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 what, three months in? So when I first started my YouTube channel, you know, I had this mindset because, you know, it's new to me. And um, the number nine, the number nine was who and how many, I should say, had subscribed to my channel. That nine stayed there for so long. That nine bothered me and it bothered me some more. And I'm like, okay, I ain't about to do this. I said, all the people out in the world and only nine subscribers, you know? So I had to get a handle on things and started to understand um, the YouTube concept. And I'm learning, I'm learning almost every day about it. And that number nine, it stayed there so much. You know, you know, God does give us tests. He tests us just to see how far we're going to go, if we're going to quit, if we're going to keep going. Well, I'm not quitting regardless of the number because first of all, I do this for the people. You know what I'm saying? So I'm not going to give up. I am, I am like so many numbers away from the nine, you know, it, it, um, it behooves me when people say, Oh, I'm at 500 um, subscribers. That number may not be big to you, but it's big to those people or to us that are watching that number gradually grow. It's big. One subscriber is big. So, yeah, I'm very grateful for the number that I do have today. And again, subscribe to my channel. Turn on your notification bell so you'll be, you'll be notified when I drop a new video. Okay? So, without further, further ado, let's jump into this video. So, you know, the other day I was, um, you know, I was rambling through the house um, and, you know, I started thinking about um, how I've seen people compete for a place in, some, in, in somebody's life, um, mainly in a relationship that you're in with somebody. I want to be the first person to tell you, if you have never been told before, and the way that I'm about to tell you. You do not have to compete for a spot, for a place in anybody's life. I want to say this again. You do not have to compete for a place or a space in anybody's life. If someone value you enough, you're going to have a place in their life. You're going to have a place because guess what? You are the place. When you know your worth and you know your position, you know your value, you know your worth. So don't let, don't let somebody put you on the back burner because they think they can. Teach people how to treat you. And if you're dealing with someone, whether you're in a relationship with a man or a woman, um, if it's a work relationship, if whatever relationship it may be, don't allow somebody to, to, to put you somewhere on a shelf then take you off and dust you off when they're ready for you, please don't do that. You're worth way more than that. And the only way that you're going to um, learn to um, teach people how to treat you, get to know who you are. Learn your likes and dislikes. I'm not talking about the minor stuff. I'm talking about the stuff that makes you who you are. Who are you? Who are you? Sometimes we... Um, we go through so many hurdles and so many other things trying to find out who we are when it's right there at your fingertips. You already know who you are. You already know who you are. You don't need somebody to tell you who you are or what you should be doing or how you should be doing it. Get to know those things for yourself. I tell you, it's worth it. It is worth it. 
There is no way, and I'm not, um, I'm not being conceited about what I'm about to say. I guess that's why I'm so passionate about this particular video. I have seen so many times where I've seen, it's mostly females because I am a female, where, you know, they felt like they had to buy a man or they had to play a certain role to keep this man or they had to do what the man said in order to keep the relation the relationship going if it ever was a relationship and also you can be in a relationship with somebody and they ain't even in a relationship with you that happens that happens so much these days i see it often i see it so i see it so much and you don't you don't have to do that I have been young before. I want I think the most that I have ever done um like in my in my in my teens because I'm learning, you know, I was learning and um I had to get to this point. But I still had standards way back then. I'm not going to let you treat me but a certain way. I had to learn the heartache, I had to learn the pain of it all. I had to do all of that just like anybody else. But I, I don't even know what movie that is, Tyler Perry. Um, he said this, I would rather be alone than have somebody in my space at this time in my life coming in to cause me um, chaos, turmoil, hurt, heartbreak. I'd rather be alone with a goldfish. I truly would. Because, baby, there is not that much loneliness in the world where you have to... Um, Damn near, excuse my French, damn near almost kill yourself to be in a relationship with somebody just to say you got a man. And man, you don't have to do that either. You don't have to damn near kill yourself or to come out of your pocket to prove yourself to a woman that you are a man. If you are a man and you are a genuine man, the woman is the woman is going to recognize that anyway. They're not going to use you for what you have. They're going to want to get to know who you are as a person, the woman. So don't go around letting people use you guys just because they think they can or you think that you can't have somebody that's worthy of being, you know, of having. You don't have to do that. So pick up the pieces, pick up yourself, um, do whatever you have to do as long as you're not hurting you and you're not hurting anybody else to get what you want, to get what you need. But I will say this before I end this video, because if you are a believer, when you put God first, you don't have to worry about those things. All you have to do is do what you know how and he'll do the rest. So put God first and then go about your merry way. He's going to see your efforts. He's going to see all that you do to try to improve yourself so, that, so you can get what you deserve. Stop with these drop shot relationships, these so-called relationships, these penny relationships, these um, ghosted relationships, these fake relationships. You don't have to do that. You can be happy all by yourself. You can do bad all by yourself. That is actually a real thing. You don't need nobody to help you do bad. If you need somebody to help you do bad, please, please, please get some help because that's not right. That is not right. Okay? So, I just wanted to put that out there. Um, Yeah. You're good, you're good people. When you know you're good, you're good. You don't need nobody to tell you that. When you're genuine, you know you. You know your heart, you know your mindset, you know your intentions. You don't need nobody, you don't need nobody's stamp of approval. You don't need nobody's validation. And it bothers me when, when I see people that feel like they need other people's validation. You don't. That's just like um, you know, this was way before I even started this YouTube channel. People I, I watched a lot of TV, I watched a lot of Lifetime. And yeah, it's real. These girls were literally almost near death 
doing things for video likes, for social media likes. That's not worth pain. That's not worth death. You know, no, it's, it's not, no, it's not worth any of that validation. Let it go. As long as you know who you are, forget the rest. So I'm going to end this video and I hope that helps somebody somewhere around the world. Um, if it helps one person, that is the goal. And I thank you guys so much for tuning in. Thank you for stopping by and thank you for watching this video to the end. Um, again, hit that subscribe button and you won't be sorry. So you have a good night. If it's night for you, wherever you are, continue to have a good day. If it's day for you, wherever you are, and I will see you in the next video. Okay. Bye.